good about oven bird, you most likely will know that their seeds are hard to get. If you check their website, there are like no available seeds. For reservation, you will need to follow their Insta account where they will announce release date of upcoming seeds, which you will need to camp for. An oven bird is located in City Gate. Chef Jeffrey often addresses his food on Insta as no class, hawker style, Japanese fusion. But what he really means is that oven bird is a simple space with slow service where he uses different techniques on Japanese ingredients. The beauty about oven bird is if you are a big eater and Chef Jeffrey prepared additional portions, you can go for seconds. The skin side, on the angawa is always very big. And as you watch this video, you come to realize that fish is the focus at oven bird, wet aged fish in particular. And you may have already noticed, Chef Jeffrey is a one man show explaining the slow service mentioned earlier. He does the cooking, plating, serving and even clearing of our finished plates. So do expect some weight in between the dishes. The fish doesn't need a lot of seasoning, it's self to carry. Okay, this one is back to normal programming, very boring fish. But uh, the next one, go back to your market. Da -da -da. Okay, so strap ah. Uh. Right, right. Oh, it's red. No, no, red, pink. Yeah. So I call this black pink. Black pink. And you really have to take your hat off for Chef Jeffrey. He's a self-taught chef with no formal culinary training. Super impressive. Made with brie daikon broth and 16 months aged cheddar cheese. The sauce looks heavy, but it isn't. Chef Jeffrey was spot on that the brie will be too oily on its own. So, that sauce with the brie, it was a pleasant surprise of a pear made in heaven. Sorry, but I just had to add that in. And for desserts, we'll serve tiramisu. 
And that wraps up my very enjoyable meal at Alvenbird. I hope it shows in the video that I had a lot of fun. Great company, great food, lots of laughter, no thanks to Chef Jeffrey's cold jokes too. <laughs> Chef Jeffrey is very passionate about his food. Ask him about the food and he'll be more than happy to share his wealth of knowledge. And the unique thing about Alvenbird is, you won't get the same dishes even if you visit the very next day. The menu is hugely dependent on what he gets from his suppliers and if his aged fish are ready to be served. So yes, Alvin Bird was amazing. If you're contemplating, contemplate no more. I've already made a booking to return in April. Thank you.